a fuel cell team is pretty much six members put together, three members on night shift and three members on day shift. And what they do is they remove and install the cell and they work around the clock until the, the job or the task is complete. We haven't had a, a cell leak in, in quite a long time, which is, which is awesome for fuel shop. We, we do it so often that we get good at it. We don't want to keep using the same cell team each time we have a cell team. So we have three levels and five levels getting trained by uh, a seven level. So when it's time for them to do the cell team, it should be a seamless transition. Donned up, all suited up, got his hood on, got his mask on, because eventually he's gonna have to get in there and start uh, digging deep, pulling stuff out, so. Number one cells, our airmen get very good training because we do them so often, so. They're very good at what they do. We got a lot of good airmen in the shop and they, they bust their hump for us. We allow every individual to come together within our section uh, and voice their opinions and concerns and possible uh, fixes to the problem. And some of the guys have come up with completely original ideas that have uh, aided us in the development uh, of, of our ultimate goal, which is to produce a, uh, an absolute solid product. And we have been able to do that.